Good morning, everyone. It's Wake My Light, and today we're gonna go over just a real quick video on how do you set up Click. Um, I've gotten quite a few requests for this one, as uh, some people have downloaded Click with LVI and stuff, and don't fully know how to set it up. So we'll go this, through this real quick. So the first thing you're gonna want to do is make sure if you have LVI, you want two add-ons. You want to download the actual Click add-on, and then you also want to download this LVI Click data text. Um, you should be able to find it. I'll have a link below to the uh, actual add-on that you will need. Um, so this provides a, a one-click, as you see here, provides a one-click access to the GUI and bind interface, right? So from here, what you're going to do is you'll go ahead and open up your spell book. And from here, right, you see all your spells. Well, you see at the bottom here, you see a weird looking tab. It's your click binding configuration, right? So what you're going to do is you'll click on that. And then you'll see that you're now in click mode, okay? So what you would do, and I went over this in another video, but we're gonna recap on this one, right? Is you're just gonna hover over whatever buttons you want, and you would press, it once you, when you're hovered over that button, you would press the key or the button, right? If you have like a Naga mouse or something, on what you would want to put there, right? So if I wanna put silence, right, on a key bind, I would, with my Corsair, right, I'm gonna, Scimitar, I'm gonna go ahead and press like numpad four, right? And so now, whenever I ho my, I hover over someone, right, I would uh, do a silence. Or the like a most common one would be something like Power Word Shield, right? So I go to my holy one here. I go to Power Word Shield, and I want to set it to right click, right? So I go ahead and click right click, and you see that it pops up here. Now I already have that, but if, let's say I want to delete that binding. You'll right click on that binding, and you'll delete it. You could also change your binding and some other stuff. And another thing I recently learned is you can also set these bindings to the spec specific, right? Um, so let's say you have some overlap for like flash heal or that kind of thing, right? Um, but you want to kind of change things around. You can actually set it now to where you can have one, those key binds set to specific specs. So let's say for my powered shield, right? You don't really use that as a holy priest, but use that a lot as a disc priest. And I use it for my uh, shadow priest when I want to move a little bit faster for five seconds, right? So what you will do is you right click on that binding, whatever binding you want to set to a specific spec. And you go down here to enable disable binding sets. And you're going to set it to um, your talents, right? So I want to have it as disc and for shadow. So I right click on it, go to enable disable binding sets. And you go to, you click on talents dis discipline and talents shadow. And now I have all that set up. So now if I hover over my uh, a unit frame, such as this unit frame, or if I have my unit frames down here for my raid, which I go over in another video, um, I right click it and now I cast Power Word Shield. But if I switch to my holy spec, because as you notice, um, my click, my I have a different uh, one for that one. You'll see that this is for spec two. This is for holy. So now when I right when I do a right click, I cast Renew on myself instead of Power Word Shield. Go ahead and hit like, subscribe. Let me know if this video helps you guys out. Also, if you guys have any ideas for things you want me to go over, any guides, tips, tricks, anything like that, go ahead and let me know in the comments below. Um, I think I already said hit subscribe, but please hit subscribe. And don't forget to hit the bell button. Know when new videos are out. And thank you for watching. Bye.